Hey, this is Dan York, and I want to show you how you could use Voxeo's Phono, a simple JavaScript library that turns any web browser into a phone, to be able to connect into a voice XML application running in Voxeo's Prophecy hosting environment. Here's what you need to do. Now, this is phono.com. It's got documentation, demos, other things that you could read about, but I want to show it to you. Here I've got a page running on my local computer. So this is right here on my system, and I've got a button here that says Test Your App. I'm going to go and click on this. Hello world. Thank you for calling this application. Have a really great day. Bye for now. Now obviously that was literally just a Hello World Voice XML application. Now it could have been anything. It could have been an IVR. It could have been a customer satisfaction survey. It could have been a direct transfer into your sales line. You could put a button like this on different parts of your website. Here's the cool part. I didn't have to download anything. I didn't have to do anything. All I had to do was make a couple of references in the HTML web page that defines this. Let me show you how you do it. The first thing you need is obviously a little bit of JavaScript, and I'll show that to you in a minute. But a key part to link it to your application is to go to the Evolution Developer Portal at evolution.voxeo.com, look in your application manager, find the application that you want to link this to. In this case, it's my Hello World Voice XML. And on the Contact Methods tab, you'll see that in addition to the phone number and the Skype and SIP number, it says Phono number down here, and it says App colon and your application ID. Okay, you need to copy that, just the clipboard or whatever else, because that's what you're going to need to tie it in together. Now, what, I've, what I'll show you here is a simple HTML page. It's super simple. So much so that you probably wouldn't want to do it this simply, but you can. And here it is. It's the, uh, the head section. Notice there's a call out to a script at jQuery.com. This is Phono as a jQuery plugin. And it also pulls down the, jo the uh, Phono JavaScript code. And in it, I've created a little function here. It's called test call. And it very simply has, uh, it says it initiates a, a Phono object. And down here it says this.phone.dial. And notice right there, there's that app ID. That's all I had to do. I didn't have to download anything, didn't have to install anything on my web server. I just put this code up there. And down here in the body, you can see that I've created a form button. And as part of that, when I click it, it executes this JavaScript function. That's all I had to go and do. Grab the app ID, create a little snippet of code, put this inside the web page, and go from there. That's all. You can learn a lot more about how to use Phono and look at the sample code and demos over at Phono.com. You can try it out. I'll put this uh, sample code up as part of the blog post as well, so you can go and see that. But that's all there is. Check it out. It's at Phono.com.